It's going really, really well. Um, it's you know, we still have a little bit of time left and we know we've already, you know, exceeded a thousand people who have been here. So we passed our numbers from last year. So we're really happy about that. We had well over a thousand dollars worth of school supplies that were all gone by 10 o'clock. So we had only been open for an hour when they were all gone. So it's gone really, really well. It's been very organized. We have, you know, 30 different vendors here um, from, you know, the various people doing the screenings, you know, the sports physicals, immunizations, scoliosis, dental, vision. You know, to of course our other vendors like Winder Farms and WIC, Welfare, Relay for Life, Food for Thought, those groups. And this event also included some of the kids from Amargosa? It did. So um, James and Assemblyman James Oscarson and his wife Rebecca um, worked with another gentleman named Cameron McRae and they worked very hard um, to get a bus organized and they went up to Amargosa and brought down some students and families so that they could participate in the event. Not only the immunizations but the web IZ and the physicals. Right, so we've had a, a plethora of things available today, like I mentioned, other than just the vendors who are here who are t educating people about the services that they have. We also have healthcare partners who's been here offering sports physicals. Um, Helping Kids Clinic, which is based out of Las Vegas, comes out every year and does our immunizations for us. And this year they partnered with Immunize Nevada and the Southern Nevada um, Immunization and Health Coalition to have immunizations for every child, no matter what their financial needs are. So that's been wonderful. We also have UNLV students um, and Future Smiles. Those are both dental groups who are here doing dental screenings. And then Dr. Leek's office is here doing vision screenings. And then on top of that, affiliated chiropractic and physical therapy is here to do scoliosis screening. So lots and lots of stuff. So important to identify any issues that might come up for the school year that might uh, interrupt some of the learning and uh, clear your child, of course, for the re requirements for school. What's coming up next for Desert View Hospital? So our next event will be our October Health Fair. It's our Autumn Health Awareness Festival, which is held October 11th this year, Saturday. That'll be from 10 to 1. Same location here at the hospital. Very similar, but of course that's geared more towards adults where we give flu shots and you know, usually have bone density screenings, hearing screenings, vision and dental as well at that too.